I, as uh, our governor, privileged to be invited, I officially and formally opened the uh, Motukoida Music Festival. Let's have a great time, everyone. All the best. It was a fine windy afternoon at Ella Beach as competitors got dressed up and got ready to perform. <laughs> Contestants were from the Motu and Koitabu villages only. They competed to win cash prizes of 3,000 kina, 2,000 kina and 1,000 kina. And the overall winners will perform at the Hirimuale festival. The contestants were asked to choose an item from the following categories. Pair of veta, The choir group had 10 different contestants performing to win the judges' vote and the string bands. The event was the first of its kind to be hosted by the Moto Koita Assembly with incredible support from partners and sponsors. NCDC on my part, we continue to support. With 500,000, we continue to support. But the important thing for everyone, for all of us, is that we don't just acknowledge we don't just, you know, do symbolic things. Importantly, we must do all we can to empower our people to live their quality of life, their standard of living, their future, our future. The city governor says he wants to see the quality of living changed and also lift the standards of living for the Motukoita villages. My program until the next election is to modernize our villages to improve it, especially where I have control and I have power, is to improve the infrastructure. We have started now and we will continue and next year we will increase the budget to do what we can to support our villages so that you all too can share the same type of services and infrastructure in the planned part of the city. Pakop says the Motukoita people are respectful and peaceful people, so people coming into Port Mosby should show the same towards them. Government was, must work with our leaders, business must work with our leaders, NGO too, church too, moving from just symbolic things, acknowledgement, saying we support Motukoita people, saying this is your land, to actual substantive things that we can together move forward. Michelle Steven, National MTV News.